Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem we're looking at function g, where g of a is equal to negative 1 16th a minus 3 squared plus 4. All right, and so this is representing the height of an arrow after a seconds from the arrow being released. Okay, so we're shooting an arrow into the air, it's going up, it's going down, and it's being measured by this. We're asked if we graph this function, where's the vertex going to be? So what is the vertex in general? Well, the vertex is the minimum or maximum value of whatever parabola you have. All right, so imagine here, this would be the vertex, it's the maximum value of this. Other way around, it's the minimum value when it's facing upwards, same sort of a deal. And when we have this form, right, so let's say just we have f of x is equal to a, where a is some constant, times x minus h squared, we're doing f of x, so h is another constant, plus k, and you'll see this is the same form, right? So negative 1 16th represents the constant out in front. Then we have a minus 3, x minus h, right? So a and x are the uh, variables in this situation, squared plus k. In this situation, the vertex is hk, right? And the analogous for g of a, the analogous vertex would be h, which is 3, and k, which is 4. So again, what does this actually mean? Okay, so a in this situation is 3, and when a is 3, g of a is 4. And so if a is 3 seconds after the arrow is released, g of a is 4 feet. So the, the arrow's maximum height, which again, this is what we're saying, the vertex is the maximum or in the minimum, but since there's a negative, this is opening downward, so it's the maximum. The maximum height was four feet off the ground. And it doesn't actually look for this, but we know now that it would be at three seconds. So the answer is D. As always, thank you for liking and subscribing, and I'll see you in the next video.